All right, everyone, today I'm gonna to be showing you guys how to replace the cabin air filter in your Corvette C7. Um, just gonna open this up real quick and then show you guys how to open up and find the spot to replace it, and that should do it. All right, so, so I had someone replace this for me last time. I didn't do it myself, but I just watched a video on YouTube last five minutes, so I should be a pro here already. I'm um, just gonna to have to lift up these three clips right here, pull this. Pull this piece of plastic down, get that out of the way. Here's the old one. Um, if you have a Z51, you're gonna have like some little oil lines across here. You can use the quick disconnects. Um, there should be some little white disconnects. You can push and pull them apart. Um, in the video that I watched, um, the guy did that because he had a Z51 uh, Car Guy 11. He's the video I watched, uh, but I just wanna make one here for you guys. Maybe it might be a little bit shorter. Um, so yeah, you can press the white quick um, connect disconnects, um, get those out of the way, and then you're gonna wanna pull this old one out here real quick. I'm just gonna kinda rip it out, I got some leaves in there. Also, there was a arrow. Um, if you see on this one, on the video, have the arrows pointing down, arrows pointing down. So this has to get flipped down. And then I'm gonna stuff that right back in there. And go on in. I'm gonna just put this in here real quick. Actually, maybe not. Try to do it on camera for you guys, but also don't wanna waste your time. All right, so upon further inspection, you notice that um, it goes down, but the slot for the air, uh, the air filter actually goes up. So you kind of have to, looks like you have to push it up at an angle and not down. So it's a little deceiving there real quick. Um, I don't know why I said real quick, but, um, so it looks like you have to push this at an upward angle instead of down. First, you gotta get it in the groove. And of course, this thing's gonna be in the way. So um, let me try to set this up here real quick. So that wasn't too bad. There we go. All right, so as you can see, I just stuffed it in there real quick. Mainly the secret is you just kind of have to force it in there a little bit. Um, this is a little bit pliable, so you can bend it a little bit. Try not to, but um, just stick it in there. Just push it hard and it should go in there. Here is the lip that you want to get it past to clear the front door cover right there. Once you get it in, I'm just gonna reverse the process here. I haven't ever put one of these back on before, but I'm gonna find out real quick how to do it. Just kind of set it there, it looks like. I'm assuming once you clip it down, it's not gonna fall out. Um, so yeah, that should do it right there. So that was pretty simple, and uh, hopefully this will help you out on your Corvette. So looks like the bottom is pretty secure, and that should do it. Hopefully this helped you out. God bless, enjoy, like, subscribe, all that good stuff. Bye.